Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, I'm just trying to get onto the comments. So if you're here, just bear with me a moment. I think we're on. Um, it's not loading my comments for a moment. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, I can see lots of love hearts and bits. Ah, here we are. Hang on. There we go. Nicola, Becky, uh, Dana, Angela, Sharon. Hello, guys. Hello. Uh, hi, Sophie. Hi, Angela. Uh, hi, Christy, Debbie. Hello. I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm not too bad. How is everybody? Uh, have you had a good weekend? My weekend has not been too bad. I was just trying to think. It's one of those um, strange weekends, I think. We wrote a cleaning list. <laughs> like a deep clean list. And then the kids can pick if they want to do any jobs for extra pocket money. So that's about the highlight of my weekend this weekend. So, um, brilliant. Hi, Cara. Hi, Carol. Mandy. Hello. Hi, Anne. Sonia. Kelly. <gasps> Excuse me. Hi, Carol. How are we all? Are we okay? Uh, now there's... It's your school holidays. Oh, is it, Kelly? Um, we, had our bank, we had our holidays... Not last week, the week before. Our half-term holiday, I should say. Oh, bless you, Alison. Thank you. So today, oh, I haven't got my uh, light on. Today is our normal live. Um, we still have our turtley treats available. And we've got um, a different flash sort of sale on the website. Because I was on the website earlier. Um, and yeah, so there's a flash sale for one week only and there's up to 50% off on some items. I think the lowest percentage off is like 30%. So between 30 and 50% off on like 40 plus items, I think it was. So there's a massive sale on the website and a lot of the items on there as well, once they're gone, they're not coming back into stock again. So it is a last chance to grab them uh, if you would like to. So it's definitely worth having a look at those. Become a supporter again, but you're paying still have no access every time I'm lucky. Oh, bless you, Tracy. Yeah, definitely. I hope Facebook can sort it out for you, my lovely. Uh, gala week. Scottish borders. Kids are on holiday now, so it's chilled here. Oh, I hope you have a lovely holiday then, Christy. Hello, hello, hello. Um, so, yeah, they've got the sale on the website, and that's on until next Sunday, so Sunday the 10th. Now, lives this week are a little bit different. Um, so we're live tonight. And then Tuesday night as normal. Wednesday night, which is our monthly charm deal live on Wednesday. And then Friday, I don't think we're live on Friday. Uh, I actually have a funeral to go to on Friday. Um, so I don't think I'll be live Friday evening and then back to normal on Sunday. So this week will be today, Tuesday, Wednesday and Sunday. If Friday's um, plans change, I will let everybody know. But if we say um, sort of no for Friday and then go from there, I hope you can all understand. Um, 15 more get-ups for you. Yes, for your summer holidays. Um, so, shall we get started this morning, this evening? Oh, my gosh.
Um, cannot wait to finish school. <laughs> I'm nervous. It's my daughter's transition day into high school tomorrow. Um, so yeah, I'm a little bit nervous about that. Right, so should we get started? Up first today is for Freya. And Freya is with Rachel. So Rachel's Grace and Freya, are you there? So, uh, Rachel and Freya, are you here? Cindy, good evening, my lovely. Uh, now, if anybody can see Rachel's grace, please comment on that comment because it will bring it forward so I can see. Um, and Rachel, if you're here, please type I'm invisible because it will bring the comment forward so I can see. Oh no, I forgot to put the other half. I thought it looked a bit weird. Hang on, I'm going to pop down the other half of the, um, of the wall. Oh my gosh, I forgot. <laughs> so basically, these, this curtain, I do pin up just because, as you can imagine, working in an office with a tinsel curtain halfway through um it does have to get especially when key is in the office and there's two of us walking around i forgot to i forgot to put my curtain down yeah <laughs> i'm just undoing it now i didn't mean to forget i just looked around somebody said they like the decor and i looked around like no <laughs> okay oh no there we go there we go brilliant okay is that better that's better Ta -da. it's down <laughs> okay so last call for rachel Grace, and if we're not we'll move on rachel and freya are you here Let me just drink this so you can take this so I don't have enough room. Okay, so I haven't seen Rachel, so we're going to move on. If she does come on, we can add her in again, but it will be to the end of the order list. Up next is Anne Dicker. Anne, are you here? That's the best bit. Thank you, Bab. Sorry, I was just finishing my, my, um, my, um, it is, it's a drink of ice. It's a, um, it's called, um, it's ginger ale, lime, grenadine, ice, so it's not alcoholic. The name's gone. Anyway, it was that, and that last bit, which was really cold, I loved the last little bit. So I'm looking for Anne Dicker. Anne, are you here? Where is everybody? Uh, again, Anne, if you're here, please type I'm invisible. It will bring your comment forward so I can see you. And if anybody else can see Anne, please comment on her comments because that will bring it forward so I can see. A large bottle of orange squash in the freezer. Yeah, it's needed sometimes, isn't it?
So last call for Anne. If not, we're going to move on again. And then again, if she comes on, we can add her in, but it will be to the end of the order list. Okay, not a problem. So we'll move on and then I'll pop her over there. Up next then is Cara Sean. Cara, are you here? Cara, hello, and you've emailed the loyalty card. I've literally just seen it, so that's perfect. Not a problem. Which means you have got two openings altogether. Now, the oysters that we've got are still the mystery or the normal oysters today. So, with your two oyster openings, uh, what two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Oh my gosh, I didn't. I completely forgot. I completely forgot. And I've had such a chilled weekend, as in not run off my feet. So I could have, should have remembered. All right, that's the top row. I'll do the second row in a moment. <laughs> okay, so mystery donate the shells is there certain colors that you're hoping for cara so there's just gonna get these open for you one and two okay so let's go down now this camera is at a slight angle here uh, let me know if it's okay if it's not i'll try and reposition it so like i say is there certain colors you're hoping for at all mystery oyster number one you've got a lighter pop there and there's your mother of pal and in here you have a darker pearl there and I'm just having a squidge for you Okay, so there's no more in that one. So if I dry this up for you here, we've got a darker silver pearl. Oh, bless you, Rachel. On Sundays, we normally start towards 7.30. But I can definitely add you back in again. That's not a problem. Okay, so darker silver to start with their car. I don't know, did it focus then? Let me just bring it up. Um. Why is it not focusing today? Let me just reposition. There we go. Okay, so darker silver for your first one. Moving on to oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster. So lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And if we have a squidge here for you, you have a second darker pearl cara as well there. And there's no more in that one. So I'm just going to dry this up again for you. So your second pearl is a darker gunmetal grey. Now he's got a slight flash of purple in him there. So you've got one darker silver and one darker gunmetal grey. And he's got that slight silver flash. Now if you're happy with these, that's perfect. So I'll need to know which ones you'd like on the jewellery. If you're not happy, I can swap one or both of them for you, my lovely. 
your silver is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. And the darker gunmetal grey with the purple flash is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he is an 8. Yep, Sophie is correct there, uh, Rachel, okay. Cara, what do you think to these, my lovely? Oh, gunmetal flash of purple on the jewellery, please. Lobster fitting on the other. Very happy. Perfect. Let me write this down. So, uh, gunmetal uh, with the flash of purple. I need, like, the silver on lobster fitting. Okay, I've got that down for you. Uh, the invoice for the lobster fitting, that will get sent over across to you to the email address on the order form. Thank you for the donations with your shells, my lovely. There we go. And that's safe up there for you. So I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Okay, perfect. Uh, and up next this evening is Angela Sylvester. Angela, are you here? I keep drawing, I keep putting my pen where I then draw on myself. <laughs> Always perfect, Cara. Oh, bless you, Christine. Well, hello, my lovely. And Angela, hello, hello, hello. Uh, you have got one opening altogether. So you would like a mystery oyster and to donate your shells as well. Is there a certain colour you're hoping for, Angela, my lovely? So if we go down... Uh, today is just mystery and normal oysters... Uh, in I don't get a delivery for the oysters over the weekend um, and then I can ring up in the morning and get an exact point because they should have been here um, last week now but today is just mystery and normal oysters so Angela your mystery oyster lighter pop there and in here there's your mother of pearl your son has requested a bright yellow. Now look at this, Angela, you are quadding. You have got four pearls in your oyster here. Uh, there's no more in that one. Now a bright yellow has not come out of the oyster. However, you can swap these. So if you're not happy with these colours, we can swap one for a bright yellow or all of them if you wanted to, my lovely. Let me show you these colours first and then you can let me know what you'd like to do. Now, all of the pearls are yours. I'll just need to know which one pearl you'd like on your jewellery. Your first pearl is a two-tonal icy blue. So he's lighter and brighter blue as you go around there. You've got a blurple, which is a mix between a blue and a purple. So as you go around, you've got darker blue sections and lighter purple sections. You've then got a dark purple. And then this one here is a two-tonal autumn peach. So again, lighter and darker areas. So three two-tonal pearls with the two blues and the autumn peach. And then you've got that dark purple in the centre there. What do you think to these? 
Now, like I said, I'll just need to know which one you'd like on the jewellery. And if you're not happy with the colours at all, we can definitely swap them for you. The icy blue ooh, is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. The blurples, not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. The dark purples, not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5 and the Autumn Peach is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He is an 8. Can we swap the peach for a bright yellow? Of course we can. So if I get a yellow for you now and then you can have a look to see if this is going to be the correct shade. And then also just confirm for me, is it the yellow that you'd like on the jewellery? So if I hold that up, is, is that yellow okay? And if so, is it the yellow that you'd like on the jewellery? Just going to bring you back up, but if it's not the correct shade at all, let me know and I'll change it out. Oh, that is, and that one's on the jewellery. Perfect, and you're very welcome. Let me just write this down for you. So we're going to have yellow on there. Okay. Uh, Angela, I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives then, my lovely that's safe up there for you and thank you for the donations with your shells as well perfect No, you're very, very welcome, Angela. I hope he likes it as well. Uh, up next today is Tracy Burton. Tracy, are you here? The itchy side of my nose there. Tracy, hello. Oh, yep, Tracy Holland, that's perfect. I've got that here. <coughs> Excuse me. So you've got a oyster opening and then a turtley treat as well. So with your, we'll do your oyster opening first if that's okay. Uh, so, oh no, uh, with your oyster opening, what type of oyster would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? mystery and donate the shells perfect is there a certain color that you're hoping for at all so mystery oyster and let's go down okay so in here oh lighter pop there And in your mystery oyster, there's your mother of pearl. And I can see a paper to this side here. You have got a lilac purple. There's no more in that one. What do you think to this lilac purple, my lovely?
Now again, if you're happy with this one, that's perfect. If you're not happy, I can swap him for you. So if I run him through the board, he's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He is an 8. Beautiful, perfect, happy to keep that one, Tracy. If I bring you back up here, let me pop him in here for you. Uh, you also then have a turtley treat. So I sorted these out earlier. So if I go back down, you get to pick which sea creature you would like. Oh, wrong way around. Oh no, it was the, there we go, right way around. <laughs> I like the animals to be facing you guys. Uh, so which animal, which sea creature would you like? You've got the green fish, the yellow turtle or the blue sea star. What do you think? Green fish, yellow turtle or the blue sea star? Thank you, Sandra. green fish okay and you have three pearls under here which means you have three oyster openings my lovely uh, what three oysters would you like with this one and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells sea star starfish I don't know I just I don't know I started calling it a sea star it probably is a starfish <laughs> um, but it is a star of the sea, isn't it? So maybe, I don't know. So what three oysters would you like? Would you like to keep or would you like to donate those shells? And which number, oh, let's pop that bit behind there. No, that'll be fine. Oh, the numbers are all mixed up. We've got one to six, seven to twelve. <laughs> I'll mix the bottom out. I'll change the bottom row around in a moment. Mystery, donate the shells, and number nine. Okay, so one, two, and three. Just gonna open these up, and then we'll grab number nine for you. One, two and three okay so number nine is this one here so it's the black uh so silver and two shades of silver i'm gonna say actually and let's go down okay oh so nothing else in there. In here you have got a pendant and it is a crystal spike pendant. So again, when we had the crystal spikes, this is the larger of the two sizes. You can have the pearl on or off the jewellery. It's completely up to you. And this is the mirror effect crystal spike, which means depending on where the light catches it, depends on what colour flashes back. So it's purples, yellows and blues. I hope you're happy with this one, Tracy. If you choose to have the pearl on this one, it sits at the top here and can move around. Or like I say, you can have the pendant as it is and then the pearls loose. I hope you're happy with that. So three oysters alongside him. So oyster number one. Lighter pop there. Oh, and a runaway. And there's your mother of pearl. Tracy, you are twinning. 
and you're twinning with lilac purples again there it's your night that's three lilac purples you have got so far obviously only two in the sand i've taken the other one and popped it on the order already so here oh here's your twinning lilacs visually it does look like you've got one which is slightly larger than the other okay so i'll measure them at the end but visually it does look like they're slightly different sizes moving on to oyster number two which again is your mystery oyster you've got a lighter pop there and in here there's your mother of pearl and you've got a apple green pearl there and let me just have a squidge there's no more in that one so we've got a apple green uh, i don't know if that is tony or not i know we've got lots of crystal pendants on the website um, so if it is on the website it will be under the crystal pendant section So here is your, sorry, the camera just doesn't want to focus today, does it? Let me just, there we go, apple green. And then one oyster to go, which again is your mystery oyster. Lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl if we have a squidge in here you are twinning there's no more in that one and you're twinning with darker purple twins so if i just dry these up for you and again visually it does look like you've got one purple which is slightly larger than the other and actually the visually larger darker purple is lighter so you've got one lighter one darker so overall you've got lilac purple twins an apple green and then twinning darker purples one which is lighter than the other if i run them through the board the visually smaller lilac is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 visually larger lilacs not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 so they're actually measuring the same size there apple green is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 he's a seven and then the darker of the two purples is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. And the lighter of the two is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. <coughs> Excuse me. So before we ask you what colours you'd like wear, I'm going to do your lucky dip. So if I just mix these, oh, let's get them. There we go. So we have this one so you have a mermaid miracle what this means uh, Tracy is you have three options with this card you can either stay as you are so stay with the pearls stay with jewelry and go from there or you can change the jewelry and go for a different turtle number or you can change the pearls which means you can change one or all of the pearls like any amount of pearls if you're not happy with them what would you like to do with your mermaid miracle? Stay as you are, change the jewellery or change the pearls. What do you think? Oh, this way around. So 
swap the darker pearls to two bronze pearls of course you can and would you like any pearls on the jewelry uh if so which which color pearl would you like on that or you can have the, the um jewelry as it is If I pop these here, just confirm if you're happy with these bronze pearls as well for me. So are you happy with those? And if so, pearl on or off? And if on, sorry, lots of questions, if on. Which colour would you like? Hello, good evening everybody. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you everyone for joining today. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Tracy? Can you message later? Of course you can. Oh, let me bring you back up. So when you um, email, if you could include the five digit order invoice number um, and then just let me know which colours you'd like where. Or of course, if you don't want the pearl on there, that's fine as well. Sorry, I've got a frog in my throat today. <clears throat> but I'm going to make a note just to say that I'm going to look for your email. So that does mean that I'm not going to obviously send this off until I've heard from you. So do let me know either way if that's okay. Okay, I've got that down for you, my lovely. So I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And thank you very, very much for the donations with your shells as well. I'm just, just going to switch these around so they're going to be in the correct order. nine and eight okay there we go they're all in the correct order now <laughs> tracy you're very welcome uh and up next today is cindy brown cindy are you here <clears throat> keeping with the water theme exactly Roz. it keeps i don't know why it's there today it keeps coming in and out I haven't got a sore throat or anything. I think it's literally just, um, yeah. I'm just gonna mute you while I pop these pearls on the tray. Okay, Cindy, hello, hello, hello. Cindy, you have got a turtley treat here. So the sea creatures in which you can pick from are the yellow sea turtle, the blue sea star, or the orange sea horse. Which one would you like? Oh, bless you, Suzanne. Thank you. Oh, hang on. There we go. Thank you ever so much for the stars there, my lovely. It's very, very kind of you. Thank you. So we've got the yellow sea turtle, blue sea star or orange sea horse. OK, 
can you have sea turtle mystery number three donate the shells perfect so sea turtle is the yellow one at the front oh it squeaked oh sorry okay so under here you have three pearls as well so again that means you've got three oyster openings there we're going to grab your oysters and then i'll grab your turtle so mystery oysters oh one and two and three and if i just get these open for you so i've got hair on my face it's tickling my nose um and then you would like turtle number three okie dokie so Oh, it's confusing me now because they're all switched around. So number three is the black, yellow and white one. I love the colour combination. I don't think you guys can see this clearly, but yeah, black, yellow and white. So the back in here, let's go down. Yep, there's space available for today, guys. If you would like to order, I'll do an updated order list once we get to the end of the current one. Okay, so Cindy... You have got a pendant, my lovely. And this is the blue beet pendant. So this one uh, is a double-sided pendant and it can have the pearl on or off the jewellery. So as you can see, it's got these blue crystals that make up the heart on the front here. So it's a gorgeous deep blue. Okay. On the reverse side, you've got this woven heart in silver so you can wear the pendant either way around either blue with the crystals or the woven hearts if you have the pearl on this one it will be able to flip around to either side and it will be at the top there okay uh, and again you don't have to have the pearl on the jewelry you can have the pendant as it is and the pearls loose but that's completely up to you and you can let me know at the end what you'd like to do okay so three oysters alongside that one is there a certain colour that you're hoping for at all? Animals, frogs and hens. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh wow. Okay, so oyster number one. There's your mother of pearl. And in here, you are twinning. And you're twinning with darker chocolate bronze twins here. There's no more in that one. So I'm just getting them focused for you. So darker chocolate bronze twins there. Moving on to oyster number two. You've got a lighter pop there. Oh wow, okay, so Cindy, there's your mother of pearl. And you actually have a chocolate bronze again. So that actually makes three chocolate bronze pearls and it's very similar to your twins if not possibly slightly darker in shade they make quite a nice set there it is actually a little bit darker you can see the color difference here if i just get that focused for you uh it's a jumpsuit this one it's like a three-quarter length jumpsuit and it's either from yours clothing or simply b i can't remember which ones this one's from Normally things are from yours clothing, aren't they? <laughs> but I did fall in love with a couple of Simply Be items. Okay, so that's that one there. And then your last oyster, Cindy. Again, mystery oyster here. You've got a lighter pop there. And in here you have a runaway. There's your mother of pearl. And you have one and two which makes three, so you have triples. And there's no more in that one. And you'll have, you have, sorry, you have triples in very pastel colors here. So we've got a pastel yellow, a pastel apple green, and a pastel autumn peach. 
so pastel yellow pastel apple green pastel autumn peach twinning chocolate bronze pearls and a darker chocolate bronze as well what do you think to these my lovely i'm going to run them through the board and then we'll do your lucky dip before we ask um about if you'd like a color anywhere so chocolate bronze number one is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 he's an eight chocolate bronze number two is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 not an eight he's an 8.5 so they're measuring different sizes there the darker single bronze is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. And then the autumn peach is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. Apple green is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. And lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8 as well. So I'm just going to bring you back up so we can do your lucky dip. So good luck, my. Um, there we go. Okay, so dive in, and we have this one. So you have a trident trick here. So what this means, uh, Cindy, is you get a ten percent off code for the website, but it means that you have to stick with your jewellery and your pearls. So, with your jewellery and pearls, my lovely, would you like any of these pearls on that jewellery at all? Or would you prefer to have the jewellery loose and the pearls as they are? what do you think i'm just going to bring you up cindy however if you'd like to go back down again to see them just let me know i think my comments are slightly behind today so please bear with me i don't want to rush anybody which is why i'm sort of um waiting for the comments to come through uh jane hello my lovely hello Can you leave it in just as it is and have jump rings on the pearls? Of course you can. So no pearls on the jewellery. And then jump rings on the others. Okay, I've got that down for you. Uh, now the invoice will get sent across for you tomorrow and the 10% off code for the website will also get sent across for you tomorrow as well, Cindy. All to the email address that's on the order form. Cindy, you're very, very welcome and I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives. And that's up there for you. Okay, uh, and up next today is Carol Grant. Carol, are you here?
Not a problem, Jane. I think it's because I sent your order, Jane, um, didn't I? And then I, I got, obviously came to the Pearl and I was oh no. So I, um, I sent it separately for you. So Carol Grant, are you here? Carol, hello. Mystery Oysters, donate the shells. Perfect. Uh, so you've got two openings all together. So one and two, if I get these open. Is there any colours that you're hoping for at all, my lovely? And two. So if we go down... Your mystery oyster number one. Quite a nice sharper pop there. Okay, so in your first oyster, oyster, <laughs> I can't speak today. There's your mother of pearl. So in here, we have got a icy blue pearl there. There's no more in that swim. We're going to wait to see what colours come out. Okay, that's just a piece of flesh, so I'm going to move that out of the way. Okay, so you icy blue from your first oyster. And moving on to oyster number two. Again, this is a mystery oyster for you. Lighter pop there. And in here, oh, how strange. There's your mother of pearl. Now you are twinning with icy blue pearls. We had this a moment ago, didn't we? We had twinning bronze pearls and then a single bronze. And now you've got a single blue and then twinning blues. How strange is that? <laughs> um, however, Carol, I'll need to know if you're happy with these colours here. Let me hold them up for you. If you are, I'll need to know which ones you'd like on which item of jewellery. And if you're not happy, of course, we can swap them for you. So single icy blue and twinning icy blues. If I run them through the board, the single blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he's a 7. And then icy blue twin number 1, it's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, .5, not a 7, not a 7.5, .5, not a, uh, he's an 8. Twin number two is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, .5, not a seven. He's a 7.5. So again, measuring slightly different sizes there. Not a problem guys, I'm going to do an updated order list soon, so then if you've ordered you'll be able to see whereabouts you are and I'll, I'll read it out as well. print is broken I think it just printed the same thing like millions of times I'll double check it in a moment Carol can we swap the icy blue for dove grey for the koala and swap the other ones for red you got the colour pearl that's on the tiara um, I 
I don't know. I'm just trying to see if I can find it. Mm, no, the closest I had, I'll show you the closest I've got to that. I'm not sure I've got any of the Dove Grey in at the moment, my lovely. So I'll have a look for you, but there may be a wait on Dove Grey. We went for a stage where Dove Greys were very, very popular. <laughs> so let me just have a look. Um, now, if there is a wait, you'll be the first one on the waiting list. Yeah, the... the I mean, I'll show you I've got this lighter silver. That, see if that's light enough for you. If not, there'll be a wait, I'm afraid. Okay, so Carol. Uh, I've got this purple, which is the closest I have to the one in the photo. Um, is there purple, red and silver okay? If not, that's fine, but just let me know. even a lighter silver is that silver light enough for you my lovely oh perfect okay so let's bring you back up take away these blues And then okay so we're gonna have silver on the koala purple on the tiara and you'd like to be invoiced for the red on a hoop fitting I've got that down for you uh, again your invoice will get sent across tomorrow for you and it will go to the email address that's on the order form Thank you uh, very much for the donations of your shells, Carol. And again, I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives. Okay. Uh, and up next today then is Anne Lewis. Anne, are you here? Uh, Lynn, thank you ever so much for the stars there, my lovely. It's very, very kind of you. Carol, you're very, very welcome. And Anne, hello. And you've got two openings all together. So you've got two mystery oysters. That's just a, a bag that came up the bag there. <laughs> Sorry two mystery oysters donate your shells as well perfect uh, is there certain colors that you're hoping for at all okay so let's go down uh, i think you're up next rachel yep you're up next my lovely if you'd like it to be today You've emailed two loyalty cards as well. Okay, bear with me a second. Oh, I think this is you, hang on. Okay, so if I bring you back up again, I've just found the loyalty card pictures. One, 
and two. Okie dokie. So let's go down. Four mystery oysters here. You've got a lighter pop there. And in your first oyster, there's your mother of pearl. And we've got a darker TARDIS blue here. And there's no more in that one. Okay, so darker TARDIS blue to start with here. Moving on to oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster. You've got a nicer deep pop there as well. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And I can see another blue pearl in there. A slightly lighter two-tonal pearl. So you're going to have a two-tonal Pepsi and TARDIS blue. So this one's just slightly lighter and slightly two-tonal as you can see there. I pop them next to each other so there's not a lot in it but definitely slightly different moving on to your next mystery oyster you've got quite a nice pop there again and a runaway pearl there and i can see a peeper in the flash as well so there's your mother of pearl and anne you are twinning and there's no more in that one so twinning darker pearls here. And these are dark chocolate. Now I think they've got a slight flash of purple to them. And actually visually one pearl is visually slightly larger than the other. Okay, and then moving on to your last oyster, which again is a mystery oyster. Light pop there. Can you top my bag up for me please, Aaron? And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And we've got a dark uh, chocolatey purple again here. I think this one's slightly more purple than the twins that came out though. And what do you think to these? So we've got a dark TARDIS blue, a two-tonal Pepsi and TARDIS blue twinning chocolate purples and then a single chocolate purple as well again if you're happy with these i'll need to know which ones you'd like on the jewelry and if you're not happy i can swap them for you so if i run them through the board for you tardis blue is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven not a 7.5 he's an eight the Pepsi Blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. Then twin number 1 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. Twin number 2 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5, so they are measuring different sizes there. And then the single chocolate purple is not a five not a 5.5 not a six he's a Can we have the smaller chocolate on the charm? Uh, swap purple, swap chocolate purple for a light bright red. No pearls, I don't have pearls on here for things. Uh, smaller one was that one, wasn't it? For a... Light bright red. 
Okay, so I'm just going to hold this up for you. Everything's squeaking today. I don't appreciate it. <laughs> okay, so is that red okay there? And I'm just going to write this down and read it out as I go, just so you can confirm if this is correct. So we're going to have the um, smaller chocolate purple on the charm no pearl on there and you'd like to be invoiced for the other pearls on oh hang on Poop. so you'd like to keep this one so keep the twin and swap out the single pearl. Is that correct there? And then have the smaller twin on the on the charm. Yeah, okay, perfect. Sorry I misunderstood that there. Okay, so that's done. Um so to confirm then, you've got the smaller twin on the charm, no pearl on the bracelet, and then you'd like to be invoiced for the loose pearls on hoop fittings. I hope that's all correct there for you, Anne. Pop that on there for you. Um, thank you for the donations with your shells as well, my lovely. That's safe up there for you, and the invoice will get sent across for you tomorrow and it will go to the email address that's on the order form. Perfect, you're very, very welcome, Anne. Okay, so up next then is uh, Rachel and Freya. Are you here? They're doing well, thank you, Linda. Yeah, doing well. Growing up. <laughs> I did, Anne, yes. That's not a problem. It was in the um, additional bit, wasn't it? And Rachel and Freya, hello, my lovely. Hello, hello, hello. <clears throat> so, Freya, I've got a little message for you. Freya. This little gift is for you to say thank you for being such a big and brave sister while baby Lucas is in hospital. And it's also a little something for you when you go to big girl school in September. Love you very much, mummy, daddy, Florence and Lucas. So I'll read you that one more time, Freya. This is a little gift for you to say thank you for being such a big and brave sister while baby Lucas is in hospital and it is also a little something for you for when you go to big girl school in September. Love you very much, mummy, daddy, Florence and Lucas. And Freya, um, that is you get one oyster opening. Um, so is there a type of oyster guys that you guys would like? And is there a certain color Freya that you're hoping for? very excited and happy donate the shells thank you very much uh, mystery oyster and freya you would love a p 
pink pearl. Okay, fingers crossed for a pink pearl then. Aaron's just topped up the bag. So let's go down mystery oyster. Lighter pop there. And in here, there is your mother of pearl. And you are twinning. You are twinning with dark purple twins here. And there's no more in that one. So twinning with dark purple twins, my lovely. Let me dry these up for you. Now we do have one pearl which is larger than the other and these two are dark purple twins. Now you can see one purple is brighter and then one purple is darker. If you would like to swap both of these or just one of them for pinks we can definitely do so. Um, it's up to you guys. If I run them through the board for you, the darker purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. Oh. Not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. And the brighter purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. Oh, thank you, Cindy. I'll do that uh, shortly. What's the biggest pearl we've ever measured? Uh, it's a nine. From our normal oysters, it would be a nine. Oh, so we can definitely swap for a bright hot pink. Now the colored blue between a Pepsi blue and an icy blue would be a Smurf blue. Um, and I don't actually have one of those in and there's actually a waiting list for that shade of blue at the moment. Okay, so Smurf Blue, there's definitely a waiting list. So I sort of show you, yeah, the closest I'm going to get to it is one of the brighter icy blues. I'll show you that blue, but I don't think that's the shade you're, you're meaning. So if you don't mind the weight, but like I said, there is quite a few people on the list for an icy blue. I can pop you on that list. If not, is there a different colour that you would like instead? Um, and also, is the pink okay? And which colour would you like on the jewellery? Lots of questions. Sorry, Rachel. Um, let me have a look for you. I'm really not coping with these squeaks today. Oh. <laughs> um, oh, I've got purples in here. That is not going to need to sort this out. Possibly this one. Yeah, look, I've got a purple in here. I need to sort. Yeah. Of course, pink on the jewellery. And Freya, I'm glad you're happy with that pink there.
what do we think to the blue? Some WD four. It's the um, it's the lazy Susan turny thing that's squeaking there. And the other thing was the animals on the the sea creatures on the the thing, and it's the squeaky day. <laughs> can't stop <laughs> I'm so sorry I'm having to drink decaf tea at the moment so it just doesn't help the blue is lovely oh perfect she's bouncing up and down saying thank you you're very very welcome Freya very welcome uh, and thank you for the donations with your shells I hope you're both happy with everything once it arrives Okay, so just popping this on here. Okay, and that's safe up there for you, my lovely, as well. Okay, now up next today is Anne Dicker. And then after Anne, I'll be doing the updated order list. Okay, so if you have ordered, you'll hear whereabouts you are. Uh, if you would like to order, there is still space available for today if you would like to order. So Anne Dicker, are you here? So sorry, let me just have a sip of my tea. Mmm. Anne, hello. Okay, so Anne, you've got one opening altogether. Mystery, Mystery Oyster and donate your shells. Um, is there a certain colour you're hoping for? So your Mystery Oyster let's go down okay so in here we've got a softer pop there oh sorry michelle sorry it's on the order form it says um it says Anne first sorry my lovely and yes, of course, I'll, I'll call you Michelle. And yeah, if I, if I ever get names wrong, please shout at me, because obviously I'd hate to call you guys the wrong thing. Okay, so Michelle, your mystery oyster, there's your mother of pal. And in here, you have got a chocolate bronze. There's no more in that one. Michelle's your middle name. Okay, so no, that's not a problem. Just as just you tell me what you'd like to be called, and that's absolutely fine, my lovely. You have a chocolate bronze pearl here. Okay, so I'll need to know if you're happy with this one, and of course, if you're not, we can swap him for you. If I run him through the board. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. What do you think to the darker chocolate bronze?
Can we swap for bridal white on a hoop fitting? Of course we can. So no pearls on the jewellery. But then a bridal white on a hoop fitting instead. So if I show you this white here. There we go. And just let me know if this one's okay. So if I bring you back up, I'm going to write that down, but just correct me if I'm wrong. Um, my name was a, my parents, hang on, let me write this down. So invoice for the hoop fitting on the lease. My parents picked mine and my sister's names off a map. Now they didn't go to that place to conceive. Um, they opened up a map and picked our names there. So I am picked, my name was after Brecon Beacons in Wales. Um, my name's spelt differently to how Brecon Beacons is spelt. Um, but yeah, so that's where my name came from. That's perfect, Michelle. Perfect. So your invoice will also get sent across for you tomorrow to the email address that's on the order form. That's safe up there for you. And I hope you'll be happy with everything, Michelle, once it arrives. And also with my name, I'm really funny with nicknames. Like I don't like my name to be a nickname. Like I prefer Brecken. Aaron is allowed to call me Bab. Um, and obviously kids can call me mum, mummy and everything there. But yeah, I don't like a nickname. Which is really strange. Some people, like my daughter's got a nickname and it's absolutely brilliant. But <laughs> for me personally, it has to be Brecken or nothing. <laughs> Uh, right, so if we do an updated order list now, I'm going to read it out as I write it down uh, and then I'll pop it on the page as well and I'll pop it in the comments as well. Okay, so up next is Janet Perling and then Rachel Jones. Oh, hang on, I haven't checked to see what's on these. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Linda Southam. Yeah, my dad, my mum and dad used to call me Breck Peck. And my school nickname, one of the school nicknames used to be Breck Star. <laughs> but I used to hate it. I just know it's Brecken, nothing else. Then it's Julie Hanwell. Uh, Lindsay Leach. My sisters are called Shannon and Kia. They're both named after rivers. Then it would be Kerry Pohl. Heather Martin. And Lindsay Kinlock. Okay, so I was talking then, so let me just go through that again. You're Joanna, I hate Joanna, and people do call me it, but I do correct them. I do prefer Joe. Yeah, we're all funny with our names, aren't we? Not funny, but we have our preferences, as we should do. <laughs> so the order list is Janet Perling, uh, Rachel Jones, Linda Southam, Julie Hanwell, Lindsay Leach, Kerry Pohl, Heather Martin, and Lindsay Kinlock. Okay, so let me just pop this on the page. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's not going to be a long wait, guys, at all. Um, and if you would like to order, there's still space available. But of course, it'll be at the end of the order list. So on the order list on the page, there's going to be a dotted line and then the new order list posted underneath it. And then I'm just posting that. There we go. So refresh the page, it will be there then. And here it is in the comments as well, if you'd like to see. Okay, so Janet Parling, are you here? Rosalind, but hate that and go by Ros. Yeah, so we all we all have our preferences, don't we? I just can't do a nickname for me personally. <laughs> I will not answer. <laughs> Daughter's Tasha. Yeah, exactly. My daughter's Aurora. Um, but since a baby, her nickname's Rara. Um, so yeah, I'll call her Rara or Aurora. 
depending on <laughs> if she's in trouble it's Aurora <laughs> but yeah Rara but her friends don't call her Rara her friends call her Aurora so yeah it's just it's different isn't it I'm looking for Janet Perling. Janet, are you here? Oh, Jan Suzanne, hello. Okay, so you've got two openings all together. Mystery oysters, donate the shells. Perfect, thank you very much. And you're hoping for lilacs or light silver pearls. Okay, so they're the two colours that I'm out of stock with. So fingers crossed they come out of the oysters for you, my lovely. So let's go down. Your mystery oyster number one. You've got a lighter pop there. Ooh. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. One, two, and three. Thank you, Sally. There's no more in that one. Your first oyster, and you have triples. And you have a sunset pearl here. Sunsets are my new favourite uh, two tonal pearl. So you've got an autumn peach, a hot pink. And then a sunset. So sunset is a yellow and coral two-tonal pearl, which give the sunset effect. So you can see autumn peach, hot pink, and then here's the sunshine yellow. And then you go round into that coral splash there. We've actually lighter, so two-tonal yellow, lighter and brighter um, yellow areas. And then that sunset coral section there as well. So that's oyster number one. And then moving on to your oyster number two. Double pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pal. And you are twinning. And you're twinning with two tonal yellow pals there. There's no more in that one. So you're twinning with two tonal yellow pearls. Now visually they do look like they're slightly different sizes. And if I just show you around the pearls, this is the visually larger of the two. And he's slightly two tonal as you can see there. And the visually smaller of the two I would say is slightly lighter overall, but does definitely have those two tonal markings as well there. So Jan, you've got the autumn peach, the bright hot pink and the sunshine yellow uh, sunset pearl. Then you've got twinning two tonal yellow pearls as well. Now I know you said you were hoping for those lighter lilacs or lighter silvers. Um, what would you like to do? What pearls are you thinking to have on your jewellery? Of course, if you're not happy, we can swap them. Autumn Peach is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. Hot Pink is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. And the Sunset is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. To uh, twinning yellow number one is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five, not a seven, not a seven point five. He's an eight. Twinning yellow number two is not a five, not a five point five, not a six, not a six point five, not a seven, not a seven point five, not an eight. He's an eight point five. So they are measuring at different sizes there with the twins as well. Now, like I said, if you did want the lilacs or the light silvers, uh, there is going to be a weight on those. Sharon, thank you ever so much for the stars there, my lovely. It's very kind of you. And Jason, good evening. I hope you're well. But 
what do we think? Two bees, my lovely. Okay, so you'd like to swap the hot pink and the peach for snow white for the earrings. So they need to be same size here. Um, I should really put my whites into different pots. So I've got whites, like I've got bridal whites, snow whites and some creams all in the same pot. I didn't want to be too pedantic about it, but I think it's time to be. All right, Snow White. Snow White, Snow White, Snow White, Snow White, Snow White, Snow White. Snow White. Snow White. Snow White. Sorry, I'm just getting the Snow Whites. All right, let's have a look to see if any of those. Oh, I've got them in the wrong hand. Only one of my hands can pour the pearls into the pot. The other hand, if it tries to do it, they will go everywhere. I'm normally quite... Am is it ambidextrous? I can't say it. I'm normally quite... Um, double-handed but with pearl, pouring pearls apparently I'm not you're okay for me to do it off the live okay bridal uh, sorry snow white sea greens ambidextrous there we go yeah, normally I'm quite ambidextrous Oh my gosh. Okay, so we've got two whites, two greens and a sunset. You'd like the... Ta -da! Let me bring you back up. Um, so we're going to have the snow whites on the earrings. Uh, did you want the jump ring on the sunset pearl as well or just on your greens, my lovely? jump ring on the just the greens or the sunset as well they are gorgeous greens aren't they Jason just the greens perfect okay you're very very welcome uh, your invoice will get sent across through for you tomorrow Jan as well to the email address that's on the order form again I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives and yeah, thank you for the donations of your shells as well. Um, okay, up next today is Rachel Jones. Rachel, are you here? Rachel, Jan, you're very, very welcome. And Rachel, hello. So you've got one, two, three openings all together. Mystery oysters and donate your shells as well. Perfect. And you're looking for a red, a teal, and an icy blue. Okay. So I'm just opening these up for you. So a red, a teal, and an icy blue. If we go down, your mystery oyster number one. Quite a nice pop with that one. Oh, 
Okay, the flesh has come away there, and you've got a pearl on this side. So there's your mother of pearl. You've got a watermelon pearl there. Okay, and there's no more in that one. So your first oyster has given you a brighter watermelon pearl. Moving on to oyster number two. So again, your mystery oyster here. You've got quite a nice deep pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And no way, we keep having doubles today. You have a second watermelon pearl. There's no more in that one. So two watermelons here. It's so strange how it's coming out today. So one and two watermelons there. And then moving on to your last oyster. Lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And I can see straight away at the top here, we've got a darker pearl. And here's a, uh, let me double check the color of him in just a moment actually. Okay, so there's no more in that one. He is a darker silver, but he does have slight purple overtones to him. Okay, so two watermelons and a dark silver with the purple overtones. Uh, Rachel, what do you think to these, my lovely? I'm going to run them through the board for you. Again, though, if you're not happy at all, we can swap them for you. So if I run them through the board, your watermelon number one is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven. Watermelon number two is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven. And the darker gunmetal with that purple overtone is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, he's a 6.5. Oh. Um, when you say teal, I'm not 100% sure um, what would be the closest to the teal. Teal's that bluey green, isn't it? Unless we go for, like, this. That's two, that's a really, that's a bright icy blue and then a lighter icy blue. What do you think to these colors here? That's okay, perfect. Okay, so with these colours then, my lovely, uh, which colours would you like where? So which colour on which item of jewellery? I'm just going to bring you back up again. The lighter or the darker blue. So red on the heart and yet yeah, lighter or darker blue on the hand. I'm guessing it's the lighter of the two, but in case I'm wrong, <laughs> I need to double check.
do you have a preference to the lighter or darker one in the cage and on the hand? I've got red on the heart, light in the cage, dark on the hand, perfect. Okay, I've got that down for you, Rachel. Uh, so to confirm, you've got red on the heart, darker icy blue on the hand, lighter icy blue in the cage. Um, thank you for the donations with your shells as well. And again, I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. Okay, perfect. Uh, so up next then today is Linda Southam. Linda, are you here? And again, Rachel, you're very welcome. I'm just going to mute you while I sort the pearls out, guys. There we go. So, Linda Southam, are you here? I think Linda was here earlier, so hopefully she's still here. Sorry, my comments are quite delayed today. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to give that moment to come through. Perfect, Linda. Hello, my lovely. Uh, so you have a turtley treat. So if we go down, oh, you've got your three sea creatures here to choose from. So we've got the blue sea star, the orange sea horse, or the purple crab. Which sea creature would you like? So again, purple sea star, no. Blue sea star, orange sea horse, purple crab. Uh, so just over a week, Beverly. Starfish, perfect. So that's this blue one down the front. So good luck. And you have three pearls in there. So again, that is three oyster openings, Linda. Uh, so with your three openings, what three oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? And also, which number turtle would you like? Yep, yeah, I've topped them all back up again. So three oyster openings. Number 10, perfect. Which three oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Number 10's been calling you, I see. So number 10 is the orange and green one. So just gonna open up the oysters first and then that way, um, yeah, we pick the oysters and then I can get your number 10 down if that's okay. 
oh, two mystery, one normal, and donate. So one and two mystery. The normal bag is just over here. Yep, that's the normals bag. Okay, so if we quickly get these open for you, there's one, two, and three. Okay, so number 10. How did I forget that? Gosh, okay, so number 10. And in the back here, and let's go down. Today we've got mystery and normal bags with the oysters. Okay, so in here... You have got a pendant, Linda. Now this pendant, I can see, definitely needs the pearl on the pendant. Okay, so your pearl is gonna be sat right in the center of the pendant here. So we do need to have the pearl on the jewelry. And it is the simple butterfly pendant. So as you can see here, it is a silhouette of the butterfly. So it is hollowed out, 95 silver. And you can see in the center there, that is where your pearl is going to be set. It's the same design on the back, but obviously it won't sit flush because once you've got the pearl on it, it will sit more uh, towards the side there. I hope you're happy with this one. And pearl definitely does need to go on this one here. So three oysters there. Would there be a certain color that you're hoping for at all? Oyster number one. There's one side. And the other side. Okay, so your first oyster. Oh, we've got twinning rose gold pearls. One's quite a nice deep rose gold colour. There's no more in there. Um, one is a slightly lighter rose gold. So twinning with rose golds, both of which are slightly different shades. Okay, so you can see that there. One's lighter, one's darker. And then moving on to mystery oyster number one. You've got a lighter pop there. Okay, and in here, there's your mother of pearl. And you have a darker pearl here. So I'm just squidging him out. And there's no more in that one. Now he is a... Darker gunmetal grey, and he does have a purple flash to him. I thought he had... um some green in him there as well but I don't think that was I think it was just as it came out there there we go so dark again metal gray purple flash and then moving on to your last oyster which is your mystery oyster double pop there okay and in here there's your mother of pearl and I can actually see a pastel lemon yellow. And there's no more in that one. Okay, so we've got twinning rose golds, a darker gunmetal grey with the purple overtone, and then a lemon yellow as well. So if I hold these up so you can have a closer look. Perfect. So if I'm going to run these through the board, Linda, and then before I ask you what you think, we'll do your lucky dip. So your darker rose gold is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. The lighter rose gold is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. Darker gunmetal grey is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. And the lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. So if I bring you back up here and do your lucky dip. Okay. 
Okay, so you have this one here. You have a mermaid miracle. So that means you've got three choices, Linda. You can either stay as you are, so um, you can stay with jewellery and stay with the pearls. You can change the uh, jewellery, so if you would like to pick a different turtle number and then we'll change your item of jewellery. Or you can change the pearls and that means you can change one or all of the pearls, it doesn't uh, have the limit on it so that's up to you. So three choices, you can either stay as you are, so stay the same, you can change the jewellery or you can change the pearls. What do you think? Keep the pearls, choose turtle number seven. Okay, so this is that jewelry, it's just gonna go over there. And then turtle number seven, changed it all around, <laughs> is this one here. So yellow and green, number seven. Let's open him up and let's go, oh, there we go. So in here. Oh, so you have got a sea themed item and you have got a anklet, Linda. So you've got the starfish anklet. This anklet's got four starfish charms on him. It's like on a snake chain base. It's got little silver ball stoppers so the, st the starfish can move up and down in their little section but then they can't go past that section okay so with this one the pearl can go on or off of the jewelry it's completely up to you if it goes on the jewelry i normally pop it on this middle section and then the pearl can go in between the two starfish here but can't go any further um or like i say you can have the pearls loose and the anklet as it is so I hope you're happy with that one. If so, what would you like to do with the jewellery? Would you like pearls on or pearl off? And if on, which one would you like? I'm just going to bring you back up. Can you have the grey on there? Of course you can. Perfect. Okay, let me pop your pearls in here and then I'll write that down for you. Okay, I've got that down for you, my lovely. I hope you're happy with that. Uh, again, thank you for the donations with your shells. No, Linda, you're very, very welcome. And that's safe up there for you, my lovely. Okie dokie. Uh, so I'm just going to top these turtles back up. But up next today is Julie Hanwell. Julie, are you here? You wanted that one. Oh, did you? It's perfect. So it was fate that it came out then on the second choice as well. And Julie, hello. Uh, so you have got two openings, my lovely, and you'd like two mystery oysters and to, oh, drop it, and to donate your shells as well. 
Uh, so would there be certain colours that you're hoping for at all? There's one. And two. Okay, so Julie, let's go down. Your mystery oyster number one. Oh, double pop there, just a lighter double pop. Okay, so there's your mother of pearl. And in here, you are twinning. Twinning with dark purple pearls there. There's no more in that one. So again, visually, they may be slightly different in size. We'll measure them at the end. And then that gorgeous, darker toned purple there. And then moving on to your oyster number two, which again is your mystery oyster. We've got a lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. Oh, and you've got one, two. Oh my gosh, you are quadding. I've never had this before. Oh my gosh, Julie. Wow, 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 wow. You're quadding, my lovely, with all lilac purple pearls all of them uh, slightly possibly different slightly slightly different shades but not a lot in it at all look at those ah! <laughs> that hasn't happened before oh my gosh and that's this that's a very popular color I hope you're happy, Julie. Wow, okay, so two dark purples and quadding lilac purples as well. Um, now, if you're happy with these, that's perfect. I'll just need to know which ones you'd like where. Uh, of course, if you're not happy, we can swap them. Uh, it's completely up to you. So dark purple twin number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. Dark purple number two is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5. So they're measuring actually the same size, even though visually look, do look slightly different. And then lilac purple number one is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. Lilac number two is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. Lilac number three is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's a 7.5. And lilac number four is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5. He's a seven. So lilac number four is slightly different sized to the other ones. Okay, decisions. Julie, what do you think, my lovely? And if you're happy, which colours would you like where? Swap dark purple for a copper bronze for the horse head and one of the lilacs on the flip-flop and pin caps on the rest. Okay, so just have a look at this bronze here. Let me know if that's okay. Just going to bring you up while I write this down. However, if that's not the correct shade, I will get to pick a different one. Um, so dark purple for the horse head so um bronze on there then we're going to have lilac on there and then you'd like the others on pink caps perfect so just confirm if you're happy with that chocolate bronze and uh, i'll go back down so you can see and i've got everything else down for you
more chestnut bronze. How about one like, hang on, let's. Okay, let me show you these four. Okay, so that is, that is chocolatey. I know it has got that red sort of tone to it, but it is based chocolate, like a bronzy colour. So one, two, three, and four. Uh, any of those, if, let me move this so I can hold it closer and still. So one is over here, then two, three, and four. Are any of those what you're looking for? Number three, perfect. Okie dokie, I've got that down for you, my lovely. Uh, now the invoice for the pin caps will get sent across for you tomorrow and it will go to the email address that's on the order form. Okay, so let me just pop these on here as well. Uh, thank you very much for the donations with your shells, my lovely. There we go, that's safe on there, and then that's up there for you. So I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. You're very, very welcome. Okay, up next then today is Lindsay Leach. Lindsay, are you here? Excuse me. Lindsay Leach, are you here? I wonder why my comments are so, uh, I've got like a lag on my comments today. I wonder why it is so laggy. Lindsay, hello my lovely, mystery oyster and donate your shells. By the way guys, when I say that, I don't mean to rush you or anything like that. I have a lag anyway. <laughs> so it's not you guys, it, it is my end. Um, but mystery oysters, donate the shells. So you've got one opening all together, my lovely. Would there be a certain colour, Lindsay, that you're hoping for at all? So if I get this open and let's go down. So your mystery oyster. Oh, lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. Now straight away, you've got a lighter, very pastel apple green, my lovely. There's no more in that one. Hoping for a brighter colour. Okay, so this is almost a yellow, but I'm definitely going to say it's more, it's just that slightly more green tone to him, but very light pastel green. What do you think? to this one sound has gone 
Can you hear me now? Is the sound on for anybody else? It's on for you guys. Okay. Uh, Lindsay, hopefully you can hear me. Thank you, Sophie. You too, Carol. I hope you're well, my lovely. It's just come back on, Lindsay. Okay, sorry. I don't know what happened there. So you've got a lighter pastel apple green. So what do you think to this one? I'll run him through the board. Uh, would you be happy with this one on the jewellery? And of course, if not, we can swap him. He's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He is an 8. Perfect, perfect. Lindsay, I'm glad you're happy with that then. Let me pop him on here. Again, I'm sorry um, the sound went for some reason, but I'm glad you're happy with everything. Uh, that's safe on there. So thank you as well, Lindsay, for the donations with your shells, my lovely. That's safe up there. And again, I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives. I agree, Roz, it did. I hope they're well, Joe. I really do. Uh, up next then today is Kerry Pohl. Kerry, are you here? Always happy. Perfect. I'm glad to hear it. Kerry, hello, 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 hello. Uh, so Kerry, you've got three oyster openings all together. What three oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? I don't think they've been on since since before lockdown, I think it was. So it's been a, like a few years now. Like I do hope everything's okay as well. Kerry, so donate the shells, mystery oysters. Not sure on the colour, so we're going to see what pops out. So three oysters here. One, two, thank you Charlotte, and three. Oh, you all right? Hmm? What was that about? Keeping the flapples out. Oh, does he want to come in? It, it, he can come in if he wants, but you have to just be ready to come get him if he wants to come out. Why are you staying here? Oh. Okay, sorry. <laughs> the, the puppy wants to come in. Um, so you've got your three mystery oysters let's go down don't know what colors you're hoping for so we're going to see what pops out okay so oyster number one. Oh, linda i'm glad they're doing okay she's i hope i hope they're okay but thank you for passing that on linda Right, Kerry, oyster number one. Wow, so there's your mother of pearl. And you are twinning. And twinning with hot pink pearls here. There's no more in that one. So 
So beautiful hot pink pearls here. Uh, so I've got, I don't know if it's another puppy. It's um, So I've got two dogs now, one of which is still called the puppy. Uh, he's another toy poodle, apart from he's red and my first one is black and his name is Rafiki. Moving on to your oyster number two, Kerry. So you've got a lighter pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pal. It's been such a strange evening for double colours, different oysters. You are twinning for a second time, Kerry. However, you're twinning with hot pinks again. Now these two, they do visually look like they're different sizes. So we've got a larger twin and a smaller twin with these two. But it's been such a strange night that we've been sort of having the same um, colours there. And then moving on to your last oyster, Kerry. So again, mystery oyster. We've got a softer pop there. And there's your mother of pearl. And why not end it up with a pink? So you've got three oysters, five pink pearls, Kerry. Now, are you a pink person? Some people love pink. Some people aren't so keen on pink. What do you think? To the pink. <laughs> I couldn't resist. Now, let me hold them up for you. Two sets of hot pink pearls and a single pink. Now, of course, if you're not happy, we can swap them for you. Uh, and I'll just need to know which colours you'd like where. It is indeed a lot of pink. <laughs> um, let me run them through the board. So pink twin number one, twin set one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. Pink set twin two, twin set one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. So they're measuring the same size there. Twin set two, twin one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's a 7.5. Twin set two, twin two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. So those twins are measuring different sizes there. And then the single pink is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six. He is a So better to have the two similar size pearls on the earrings. So the two that are measuring the same are the top two here. So you'd like the top pinks on the earrings. That's not a problem. And what do you think to the other pearls? That sounds amazing, Sally. Oh my gosh. And to be there and then to have, oh my gosh, I love that. I'm sure time will fly by for you to bring uh, him or her home. So keep the 8.5. One for a Pepsi Blue one for a sea green and which colour would you like on your fitting
right fitting for a necklace? Um, depending on the size of the chain, yes, you could have that on a necklace. If the chain's slightly bigger, then I'd say um, you'd possibly want a... Am I allowed to say what it is and I can describe it properly? And are you happy with these colours here? It's a small chain, yeah, you can describe. Okay, so because it's a jump ring, it's a five mil jump ring. Okay, so if um, it's a smaller chain, with the small, the more so the end of the chain to thread through, if it can fit through the five mil jump ring, then, I, then yep, you can pop that onto a chain, onto a necklace, and it'll be absolutely fine. Um, if it is slightly larger, I do have larger jump rings, which are slightly different price, so it's the same style, just a slightly larger. And they go up in point uh, fives, so no, they go up in fives. No, they go up in ones. Oh my gosh, they go up in a mil at a time. So five mil, six, seven, eight, nine mil. Um, or you have ov obviously the hoop fitting, which is like the slide-on fitting, and that would um, fit on the pendants as well. So the fitting you've got is absolutely fine as long as the end of the chain isn't too big to go through the five mil jump ring. Does that make sense? Larger jump ring, please invoice for it just to be on the safe side. That's not a problem. Uh, I'd probably go for the seven mil, just to be sure. Or would you prefer the six mil one? I think seven mil will be more than enough. You could go larger than that. Like I said, go up to nine mil, um, but that is quite obviously that's just under a centimetre. So I'd say seven is quite a safe bet when it comes to chains, if that's okay. Yeah, seven mils fine. It's to go on your pendant for your granddaughter. Oh, uh, and the blue. Oh my gosh. Okay, so seven mil, and we're gonna have the blue on there. Um, it's I can't remember the price off my top of my head, but it's not much at all. Um, at all. But I'll get the invoice sent across for you tomorrow. Well, I hope. Uh, I hope the pearl uh, sits on the on the necklace on the pendant nicely for you, Kerry bless you um but yeah i hope you're happy with everything there oh let me just pop down with that we're gonna have the pink twins on here as well i've popped the pink twins in their own bag so it's not going to get mixed up with the single pink pearl at all all lovely perfect well i hope you're happy with everything my lovely uh, that's safe up there and again thank you for the donations with your shells as well Okay, up next on today is Heather Martin. Heather, are you here?
you guys are such a lovely community honestly it's so nice i don't say it very often but being on this side and even just seeing the, the comments and the conversations you guys have between you um, obviously i can't comment on a lot and i do miss some of it but um yeah you're just such a lovely community to just sit on this side of it and to read and then to obviously join in slightly it's lovely honestly it's lovely Heather, hello, hello, hello. Uh, you have got a oyster opening and a turtley treat as well. So if we do your oyster opening first, sorry, I've got an itchy lip. Oh. <laughs> if we do your oyster opening first and then your turtley treat afterwards. Uh, so with your oyster opening, what type of oyster would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Sharon, thank you for the stars there, my lovely. It's very, very kind of you. Again, thank you, my lovely. Oh, bless you, Cassie. Thank you. natural and donate is there a certain color that you're hoping for so natural normal oyster get him open and then let's go down heather my lovely okay so in here there's one side And the other side. Okay, so in here. Oh, and you're twinning. Okay, so twinning with uh, bridal white twins to start with here, Heather. So I'm just going to dry these up for you. Oh, Carol, off the top of my head. I'm not sure um, if it's on the website, then it's in stock. Okay, so bridal white twins here. What do you think to these, Heather? Uh, visually, possibly slightly different sizes. I'll measure them in just a moment. And if you're happy with these, that's perfect. And again, if you're not happy, we can swap them for you white number one is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 and then number two is not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 not a seven he's a 7.5 so they're actually measuring the same size just possibly visually slightly different there what do you think to these would you be happy with one of these bridal whites on the jewelry or of course if not we can swap them for you Do you think? Uh, we can indeed. Okay, so with your turtles, oh, sorry, just missed the bag then with that one. They're both in there. So I'm just going to bring you back up and bring the tray over. I just need to take the blue one off. So I'm just going to mute you while I uh, add the next set of pearls on.
Okay, so if we go down, you have got the green fish, purple crab, or orange seahorse. Which one would you like? Good night, Linda. Thank you for joining us today. Orange seahorse, purple crab, or green fish? Heather, which one would you like, my lovely? I did, Joe. yeah. <laughs> I find it therapeutic. I'll show you something else which I did, um, if you want to see. Seahorse, please. Been shouting at you all night. Okay, so seahorse is two pearls here. So that means you've got two oyster openings. Uh, so I'm going to bring you back up. What two oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? And the turtle picks. Yeah, I painted those. And cut those out and popped them all together and stuff, yeah. Oh, bless you, Carol. It's very kind of you to say, my lovely. <coughs> Mystery and keep the shells with this one. Okay, so would there be certain colours you're hoping for here? And which number turtle would you like? So one and two oysters. I'll just get these open. For which turtle number would you like? one and two so it's one to six and then seven to twelve light greens and blues and number four and number four is the blue one. Okay, so in here, let's go down. Oh, again, if it's got a label on it, it's just to tell me what it is. It's okay, so you have got a set here. So you've got the twinkle set in silver so what that means is it comes with a pendant and matching earrings the earrings are stud back earrings it's all 925 silver apart from obviously the crystal element uh, now it would have um one pearl which would go on the pendant so the earrings would not have any pearls on them okay or you can choose to have um you can choose to have no pearls on the jewellery. I can't get that on there. There we go. You can choose to have no pearls on the jewellery and have it as it is. It's completely up to you. Now the earrings, are, they're slightly mis-angled. Um, uh, they're at different lengths. But look at that. So it's in that gorgeous smoky silver colour with the crystal hearts there. And then the pendant if you had the pearl on it, it would just sit at the top here again would move around earrings are the same but no pearls on the earrings okay so you can have the pearl on or off of the jewelry and it's gonna oh it's gonna be up to you so i hope you're happy with that two oysters here light pop there Okay, so there's your mother of pearl. Oh, the flesh has come away beautifully and you're twinning. And there's no more in that one. Mm. 
which actually came away beautifully for the um, shells because you'd like to keep them. Okay, so twinning with darker twins here. Now these are definitely uh, different sizes. Now they've got darker gunmetal grey. And you've got one which is visually larger, one which is visually smaller. And of course we'll measure them at the end for you. Okay, so there are your darker gunmetal grey twins. And then we're moving on to oyster number two. You've got a deeper pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. And you've got a great purple pearl that's popped out there. And there's no more in that one. Okay. So again, I'm just cleaning up the shells here for you. So you've got twinning darker gunmetal greys and then you've got a grape purple as well. What I'm going to do is I'm going to measure these through the board and then we'll do your lucky dip, my lovely, to see what we'd like to do with the pearls and the jewellery. So twin number one is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. Twin number two is not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5. He's an eight. So they are measuring different sizes there. Great purple's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six. He's a 6.5. <laughs> Sorry, I've got hiccups. If I bring you up for your lucky dip. So I'm just going to mix these around first. Okay, and you have a mermaid miracle. So this mermaid miracle means you have got your three choices. You can either stick with everything that you've got. So stick with your pearls and stick with your jewellery. You can swap the jewellery by picking a different turtle number or you can swap your pearls and that means you can swap one or all of them or any number in between, it's up to you. So three choices that card means, sorry I'm just wrapping up the shells as well. So you can either stick and stay as you are, don't change anything. You can change the jewellery or you can change the pearls. What do you think and what would you like to do? Thank you, Laura. That was the um, comment from before, though, I believe. So this is, we had number four to start with. Yeah, there's an issue, I think, with comments tonight, Joe. I think it's just coming through, um, especially to me, at different stages, I think. I'm trying to read it the best I can. So the bigger twin on the heart pendant and the smaller twin you'd like to swap for a sea green and the sea green on the other. Okay, so if I just hold up this green here, just have a look, confirm if you're happy with that one. 
hang on, let's move it away from the purple so you can see. Okay, so just confirm if you're happy with that one there for me. And I'm going to bring you back up. I'm just going to write this down. If it's not the correct shade, though, do shout at me. Let me know. Um, a lighter green than that um with the sea greens possibly that one's slightly lighter let me show you yeah that one's slightly lighter So the one on this side. Would you prefer that one? That's lovely. Perfect. Okay, so the lighter green is yours, my lovely. Okie dokie. Heather, I hope you're happy with everything there. I've wrapped up these shelves. Thank you for the first shelves, but I've wrapped up the mystery shelves for you. That's safe up there. And I do hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives, my lovely. Okay. And that's up there as well. You're very, very welcome, Heather. Up next is Lindsay Kinlock. Lindsay, hello, my lovely. Um, so just double checking the email address. That's perfect, thank you. So you've got one opening altogether. You'd like a natural oyster and donate to the shells. That's perfect. Is there a certain color you're hoping for, Lindsay? So let's go down your normal oyster. There's one side and the other side. Uh, yep, Heather, that's not a problem. Which earrings would you like? Lindsay, your normal oyster. Oh my, look at him. You've got a two-tonal rose gold. There's no more in that one. Let me show you this two-tonal rose gold. Okay, so... lighter and darker it is gorgeous let me just reposition it lighter and darker rose gold what do you think to this one Lindsay my lovely now again if you're not happy with him we can swap him for you if you are happy then that's perfect so I can pop him on the jewelry for you as well there we go
delighted with the pearl perfect Lindsay let me bring you back up here that one is yours and I'll get him on the jewelry he is stunning I don't think the camera's picking it up as clearly but it is gorgeous so I hope you're happy with him my lovely that's on there for you and I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives as well and that's safe up there the simple studs I've got that down for you Heather and the invoice will get sent across for you tomorrow as well okay very very welcome Lindsay perfect uh, and up next today is Tracy Burton Tracy are you here Tracy, hello. Oh, I'm sorry, Tracy. It's because the name, but I can see it here, so that's not a problem. Uh, you have got four openings altogether. What four oysters would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? You can indeed. Neil, good evening. I hope you had a um, good shift at work. So two mystery, two, oh no, that's a stinky one. One and two, yeah, the stinker. Let me pop that over there. Okay, so two mystery, two normal. Um, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? And is there certain colours that you're hoping for, Tracy? Okay, so let's go down. Your mystery oyster number one. Lighter double pop there. And in, oh, sorry, in here, there's your mother of pearl. Donating the shells, perfect, thank you. So in here, we've got a lemon yellow pearl. There's no more in that one. So lemon yellow to start with there, my lovely. Moving on to oyster number two. So again, we're going to go for your mystery oyster. And quite a nice deep pop there. And in here, there's your mother of pearl. You are twinning. Twinning with blush pink pearls here, Tracy. There's no more in that one. And there are your blush pink pearls in the sun there. Moving on to your next oyster. So we're moving on to the normal natural oysters now. Okay, so there's one side. And the other side. And your first natural oyster. You've got a deep rose gold. There's no more in that one. He is. He's a deep, almost like a pinky rose gold, actually. Base rose gold with a slight pink overtone to him. And then moving on to your last oyster, which again is a normal natural oyster here. There's one side. And the other side. 
Oh, and a backwards runaway. And there's no more in that one. We have a snow white. Okay. Tracy, what do you think to all of these, my lovely? Let me pop them in here and then I'll hold them up so you can have a closer look. You have got a lemon yellow, twinning blush pinks, a base rose gold with a, ro uh, with a pink overtone and then a snow white. Now again, I'll need to know which ones you'd like wear. So if you're happy with these, that's perfect. If you're not happy, we can swap them for you. And if you'd like some time to think about it, you can take a screenshot and then email me your choices over if you would prefer to. If I run these through the board, your lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, he's an 8. Blush pink is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. Blush pink number 2 is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. Pinky rose gold is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 and Snow White's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5. He is a 7. Good night. Uh, rose gold similar. Mm. I always say with rose golds it's best to try and match them in the daylight just because there's so many um yeah i would have one similar but if it's okay with you i'd like to match it in the daylight um i've gone into the pink natural pink pot because in here as you can see this one's a rose gold with a pink overtone as well that's just slightly lighter the one you've got but i definitely think i'll be able to match it um oh like that one oh it's just slightly darker um but i think if it's okay if you'd like to do it in the daytime just because like i say with these colors it's just so you can see there's there's definitely going to be one there that's going to match it it's just to find it if it's okay there's a not in not a lot in it with the different colors which is why i prefer the daytime just with um the rose golds and normally the the lighter natural colors actually Okay, so let me bring you back up and I'm just going to write this down. So we're going to have, um, so swap white to match rose gold. And like I said, there's definitely going to be a match in there. If for some reason there's not, I'll pop you an email over. But if you don't hear from me by tomorrow lunchtime, it means the match has been successfully swapped. I'm like 99% that I'm definitely going to be able to get that swap there for you. Um, rose gold on the hook. And then pinks on the other ones. Perfect. I've got that down for you, my lovely. Let me just pop them in here for you. Uh, thank you as well, Tracy, for the donations with your shells as well there. And again, I hope you're happy with everything once it arrives. And that's safe up there for you. Sorry, I thought I just saw a spider, but it's not a spider. It's okay. 
<laughs> perfect. Um, perfect. Uh, and that is the end of the order list today, guys. Thank you all for watching. Um, don't forget that our the massive sale uh, is only on there till next Sunday. Uh, Turtley Treats is on for another week as well. And we'll be back again on Tuesday evening for a normal live, Wednesday evening for the monthly charm deal, uh, and then Sunday evening. Okay, so I hope you'll have a brilliant start to your week and a Monday morning, and I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.